All right, we have enough for 10. I'm just gonna do 10 pull instead of singles. Uh, hope for the best. Let's see, can we get Nahita? And we did. I won't even know since we already got Diluc last time, I think. Was, was it Diluc or was it Jean? I forget. Nahida! Alright. So we're good for this banner. Now we're saving. Even though I only have one wish left anyway. So the other person I'm going to roll for our next banner is Yomika. Since we got her, what can't we? It's Nahida! Alright. <laughs> Alright, that's uh. What was I doing? Okay. Relaxing days like this are nice. Let's take it easy. Oh, yeah, okay. I remember now. Oh, uh, maps. So, okay. All right, the continuance of the fungi event. So let's see. Okay, so we're doing attack one first. Wait, let me check. Is the max for the challenges? This is what do I need? What wrong one? Is it this one? Okay. Alright, so at least I have to get at least 2,000 for... Oh, okay, never mind, I see the... Okay, so I see. Uh, okay, so that's all done. Caching is all done too. Alright, so we need to at least get two, 2k for each uh, part. Start the special training. In some stages, she can switch supporting fungi into paddle, uh, wait, into combat if one of the current active fungi falls. Okay. I wonder if I get rep or any XP's for my... Oh, never mind, I can't since I'm the I say, traveler. Alright, so we got... Cryo and Hydro. So I guess we'll use fire. Fire, definitely. But we'll... Okay, so... Defense and our support. Sweet. Attack, attack. Water. I don't think I need water. Wait, it's water. In case anybody falls, I guess I'll bring the healer. Alright. Confirm lineup. I target all oh, no miners so more than uh got it.
weiß, da ist kein Easy. Oh, there's three phases, right? Uh, okay. Probably use the same team. Was that water? Targeting the mage. Stop. No, stop. Went down. This is the second round, I think. That's the way right now. It's <laughs> like uh, waiting for one leaf to pop up just to do us. Uh, Interrupt them! Yeah, I will finish uh, most of it uh, last yesterday. So we're doing the attack and defense part uh, today. Not a good, uh, not a good, uh, what's it called? Since he, he's ice and my guy's water. I believe in you, Bongo Head. <laughs> this is a backup. <laughs> the other group died. <laughs>
Retry. Yeah, he was a backup. Uh, I'm gonna put him in the main group. Uh... How do I take him out of the group? Oh, wait. Okay. I think it's because I didn't have a healer in the other one. Fire. Well, I don't need electric. Let me, uh... Wait, is that what their health is right now? Let's see. Okay, let's, let's start with this, see how we do. I think before I didn't have a healer in the group, so maybe that's why everybody uh, perished. Bad idea putting in him as a support. We got uh, over 2,000. That's what we need for each uh, event, anyway. This is the event. I'll start the other event that uh, well, expires in the two or three days. Electric, pyro, oh, so every every class. Twirly, whirly. Support would be this attacker. Alright, let's see. Okay, let's start it up.
Back there, so let's see. I don't think any. Yeah, I don't think any need to change. Recommended? Do I have. Alright, I think I have the recommended. See, so we have track cryos, so I need at least fire. Fuck, okay. Cryo. Let me uh, move this guy out of. Okay. That should be good. <laughs> Thank you. 
So is that two, two events so far? Two stages, I mean. All right, it's good. So we're just trying to get two, at least two K for each one, anyway. Hydro slime, okay, hydro. Bring the healer. So which electric is this one? Uh wait, there's two okay, I'll bring the wait no, I don't want. Okay, that should be good. Um let's see what what does this guy do? Wait, I can't Okay. Bring two electrics. I need a shield character. Okay. For some reason, I thought they were like healing themselves. Like, how did they kill four again? <sighs> Next zone. Cryo, I think same same no I need fire this time. Cryo. Wait, it's electric cooler too. I think it should be wait. I should at least bring fire. Since we already have a defense. Geo. I think I sh wait. Geo. Let me. Do I have? So I want to get one of these. So what do, wait, do I even have a? Okay, there it is.
see what's the means of that one. I knock him down this time. Alright, nice. Last, last attack one. And then we're up to the defense part. <laughs> Earth Guard. Oh, I'll just do my regular team. I need a defense. I guess. Knock him on his. Phase two, oh, it's. I might need fire, let's see, fire, fire. Oh, I'll just do a defense fire.
Wait. Did he just get HP? So do we... Uh, that one took a little while. Cryo, okay. Cryo, cryo. Only the wind, I... Wait, I can use the wave. Cryo. I should... Let's see, I don't... I think I fire guy in. Okay, cry out with. Wait, so I have. Okay, one, two, three, four. Try, try. It's only instead of. Uh... Attack, attack. Alright, let's move this guy out. Should we good, I guess? Nice, we got it off. Whew, 24. Alright, thought we might have messed up on that one. Uh, since that mid that first phase, I think we took a while. Okay, so those are all complete. We already got everything over 2k, which is nice. That's the defense. Uh, okay, defense. Oh, oh, okay, so this is... We're defending, um... Monolith. Alright, we'll see how that goes. Alright, so I don't get... These, okay. I guess they didn't give us a choice, so we only have these members. Round pow! Nice, 27, 80. So I think, <laughs> for some reason I feel the battle one with the other 
uh, you know, with the other trainers are more and more uh, interesting than these. Cryo. Oh, also, we got all the forms again. Electric. Wait a sec. I still like my defense, so I'll use fire as attacker. Uh, wind? Do I need wind? Right, I'm just gonna use the this team. Oh! Oh, I forgot to put the support in. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna need it. So I guess we'll finish this and we'll get out, go to Port Almost. I like the cool So I guess I thought that I finished the other block, but I guess I didn't. Wait, how do we... Wait, did I just skip the... <laughs> I guess I skipped it by accident. Okay. Alright. Regular team. Wait, regular team with... No, I just use this for now. Wait, cryo. Cryo, fire...
Alright, so I guess of course mostly for these uh, fungi, I do actually don't know where they are located, so they don't like, you know, do their move away from all the um, enemies. <laughs> So two more left, then we'll go back to the event. <laughs> electric and... Okay. Electric and pyro. Electric and pyro. All right, so I'm gonna electric power ice. Wait, ice defense and need it. so healer. Also have attack def. Okay, so stand them all. Uh, I didn't do electric, I guess.
Uh, that's the high so far. And the 3K, 3300. Alright, the last one. Alright, so it's a basic characters. Let's see. Do I need fire? Probably don't need that one. Attack. Great defense. I say like my ground stop. Alright, let's be. To redo this one over. <laughs> All right, so healer, the ground stop. Ice is good, and so that's attacker, stamina, stamina, and right. Oh, wrong, wrong. Oh, I hit the, I hit the wrong person. Thing is, <laughs> well, I guess it's based on the team, so that's 
we, we completed that. Let's uh, collect everything. And then, uh... Let's see. So I think we can collect the, the Bori also now. Uh, go to attack. Wait, how do I go up? Oh, wrong button. Okay, that's why. Alright, so we collect everything. Uh, eventually, oh, I think let's pick up Dory first and then we'll pick up everybody else. It's an invitation! Okay. Nice. Bench shot. We'll buy. It. Hopefully, we we'll buy everything out. Oops. Okay. Wait a sec. Okay. Just making sure it's separate. So. Alright, event shop bought out for regular. Alright. So, this event is totally done. Oh, wait, I think let's go to Port Ol Armos. Alright. Okay, let's go to Port Armos and see what's left over at that area. <laughs> Do I still have anything over here? Wait, what, let's check what's... Can she talk? Everything is fine now. Okay. I'm not sure if anything is important what she's saying. So we want to train the fungi. Okay. Can we still do any fungi? Nope. We can't. So, let's see. We're supposed to meet... Wait, did it say we... Okay. Twirly whirly! Traveler, Paimon, Bongo Head, over here! Hey, Layla! Have you and Twirly Whirly been having fun these past few days? Definitely. With Twirly Whirly helping me carry my luggage, we could go camping really far away, and I got to see the stars from a different perspective. Oh, I even managed to make some progress with my paper. Uh, although, I've tried making almost everything on my food list now. Every time I used a flower or something, it got in the air and gave me a coughing fit. <coughs> but after all that, I still haven't figured out what Twirly Whirly likes. It would be great if the improved Wisdom Warp allowed us to communicate directly with the fungi. Uh, oh, oh, I should mention that in my letter and get someone to ask a Senior Immorta Scholar. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, you're earlier than I expected. So I guess he's heading back to Inazuma. Nico, you're not leaving, are you? It feels like you never got to properly enjoy your vacation here. Oh, my needs for amusement have been more than met. Thanks to your help, our little inspiration hunt went perfectly. Not only did we gain invaluable experience in the tournament, we also had all the excitement of exposing a criminal conspiracy. Yes, I think I might ask Soka to ditch her original characters and just make you the protagonists <laughs> in her next novel. You are helping behind the scenes. True. It all makes sense now. You dropped so many hints, but it went over Paimon's head at the time. Why didn't you expose El Hingen right away, though? Why wait for things to escalate like they did? Going for the big reveal right at the beginning would have been an anti-climax of the most literal kind. I wanted to see how you'd react in a situation like this, and you did not disappoint. I thought that the story between you and the fungi would follow a master-servant paradigm, but you offered something even better. Companionship, based on mutual understanding. From a certain point of view, it seems fitting that El Hingen, the one person who could barely keep the word master from his lips, met his downfall at your hand. Of course, considering what he's capable of, I'm sure he'll have his ways of continuing to put up a fight. Uh, Paimon's getting confused again. In the future, we should take notes when Miko's talking and carefully look over them later. Oh, that's enough chatting for now. I'll leave Blitzara in your hands. Remember to take good care of it. I hope you really give this a good shot, you and Hania. The future of this highly entertaining tournament depends on the decisions you make from now on. I'm excited to see what you've got in store for us. Talk to Susie. Was the picture person again? I don't think she's part of this quest, so I'll just skip most of the text. Let's see, where are we taking the picture this time? Okay, so in. Capture everything. Centered. Are we good? Wait. Oh. Most like comment. Um. All right. Wait. Oh, I forgot to change my party members. Right. Let's make the new party. Time to broaden the horizons again. We'd like to thank all the competitors for their attractive performance and the support of all of our audience. The first season of the Nilo Pella Cup Beast Tamer tournament has come to an end. Although there was a few hiccups at the end of the finals, they were all resolved by the champ. Oh. Due to the technical difficulties, we are unsure as to when the next season of the Nilo Pella Cup Beast Tamer tournament will be hosted. However, we promise that we will resolve the issue as quickly as possible and bring back the competition that. You all enjoy. Meanwhile, please continue to show your support. Let's see, what is the most liked comment? Although I really hope that the Neopola Cup will continue to be held, after finding out about the flaws of the Wisdom Orb, I fully understand behind Silver Companion's decision. Health and safety is definitely the top priority. I hope that all the competitors are safe and continue to maintain their friendship with their fungi companion. That way, They'll be able to return to the arena and bring us even more exciting competitions. 
<laughs> There's a number of comments stating people's understanding of Paimon's decision, a concern of the condition to, of the competitors, and their hopes of the competition being continued in the future. Alright, what is the most... What's the, what's the last one? The most dislike? Everyone seems to be happy with the fierce match and Paimon's victory speech. There are no negative comments. Alright, that's good. So, I think we're finished with this quest, right? Owen, say goodbye to your shroom buddies. Alright. I guess we have to meet Hel Helia. Wait, where is she anyway? <laughs> oh yeah, this week I could finish the rep for Sumeru. So we can get new wings. Then I guess I have to farm some of the flowers just to get all the... Hello all. Dead right on time. I've collected all the other contestants' wisdom orbs and found a suitable place for our fungi friends to live. I'll make absolutely sure the surrounding environment is not affected. Say hello to everyone, Kindlejoy. Kindlejoy? Oh, so she renamed Pyro One? That's Pyro One's new name. When I saw how well behaved it was when we first met, a sense of joy welled up inside me. If I just let go of my preconceived notions about fungi and allowed myself to truly feel that moment, maybe I could have felt like that all this time. I'm so glad Hania has finally worked things out. <laughs> yeah! Even though Paimon has gotten used to the name Pyro One at this point, the new name holds so much more significance! Congratulations to you too, Kindle Joy. I will commit to giving these gentle creatures the highest standard of care I can provide. Please, rest assured that your fungi friends will be safe with me. I guess it's time for us to say goodbye. Go on, Twirly Whirly. Be a good fungus now and do everything that Hania says. But Zara, Mika will be back to visit when the next Beast Tamers tournament comes around. High five, Bongo Head! It was really fun having you around. Paimon hopes that you have a good time at Hania's, and is really looking forward to seeing you again next time. We'll meet again. That's a promise. I hope that the day when humans and fungi can live in harmony will come quickly. I believe in you all. You'll make it happen. I look forward to the good news. I wonder if she has like a is it is it, is it like a ranch or a daycare now. <laughs> well, we finally finished the event. I think I saw a uh, Aranera around this place too. I think it was a materials one. Oh, right, here it is. I think I hope it's a material one. <laughs> Oh, this puzzle one. Okay. Remember the painting with the most strokes. Oh. <gasps> painting with the most strokes. Okay. What am I still looking at? Okay. Oh. oh I didn't pay attention. I'm guessing it was this one. Is that right? No. This one? <laughs> right, let's see. Also, I got two of them right. Okay. Yeah. 
You get it. Find anything you like? So the first two guesses we did were correct, but I was like, uh, oh, which one are we? <laughs> Alright, let's see. Alright, that's an easy one here, too. But where's the... Where's the other mushroom? Yeah! 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 Hopscotch! The worst... Oh, yeah, I missed it. Nice, we got it. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Uh, we'll s Can we get her? Can we get it? Alright, oh, nice. <laughs> That's good. Everyone hold hands! Hey! Oh, I guess that. <laughs> That was a mess up. Everyone hold hands. Hey. Oh, that that, that didn't collect. <laughs> Everyone hold hands. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. That's easy. All right. Let's see what the uh. Oh yeah, we'll check what we next. Okay, we finish this event. We'll continue on this one. We'll s wait, ma what? All right, so we could go straight into it. Okay. All right, so this is actually kind of easy. I th I hope. Knock the slimes into the vine go by triggering the overload reaction with Yanfei or please attack to score points. During the challenge, all party members cannot use their. Oh, they can't use their bursts. Okay. So we're at the regular attacks. Okay, that makes it easier. Get in there. Oops. Oh, wrong way. Oh, come on. That's kind of easy. Okay, so 
challenge to smash and bash. Razor. Use Razor's attack to break the explosive rocks. Okay, I missed. Alright, we'll figure it out. Only one side, okay. We're supposed to pro break up the... I still sh Wait, can we... Okay. Manly, I uh, yeah, I started this. I finished the other mush, the fun guy event. So we're doing this event right now. H how's your day? How's everything? Wait, what? I didn't read what I was supposed to do for Ka with Kazaha. Time to go. The wind knows me. To the wind. <laughs> One with nature. Clouds high. The birds call. The wind knows me. Into the wind. Fallen leaves adorn my night. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully, I was doing it right. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, because uh, the first thing I did before I started my event was uh, do the tempo, and like I and I got this. I'm like, oh, nice. So now we're gonna try to uh, roll for Yomika uh, in the next banner once it comes out. Oh, there was, okay. I didn't realize there was three parts. Okay, so the same thing for this. Okay. Yeah, so I'm not sure if you started any of the events yet, but I guess this one's pretty easy. It doesn't take that long. It's just a fun guy. Well, the fun guy quest was pretty fun. Uh, I know you do get a free door if you do all the uh, events. Uh, challenges so <laughs> I think you might like it since it's I guess people are comparing it to like Pokemon or like Beyblade or whatever <laughs> like it's a pet it's a fun guy battle oh even for uh I'm not sure if you uh if you were here when I was doing my uh, the starting the starting soon screen, the BR BRP screen, and the ending screen, how now has like music clips onto it. Wait, so what am I supposed to do there? Take it easy. No! 
<laughs> That's funny. Take it easy. So if you, I'm not sure if, I'm gonna show you my uh, BRB screen. I think it has a. Let me just pause it a little bit. Wait. Can I pause it this way? So my BRB screen has uh, this is like a music clip. Right? to do for this. <laughs> I didn't know uh she could do that that. Lana, how's everything? How's your day? I'm just finishing up the events. I already finished up the fungi uh, event. Uh, I know. You, I think you were here yesterday. So we're not doing this event now. And this will look like it's pretty fast. So I'll probably finish this pretty soon. And for Saya, I didn't realize she could uh, that she could do that just with the elements. <laughs> oh really? Does it like is it like different challenges or is it like doesn't matter? Because I know some events uh, there's a. Uh, stuff if you do it with uh, multiplayers. Wait, wait continuous trigger oh Don't blink. Wait so what am I supposed to do? Con Chalice exchange. Speed of light Okay. Incoming. I see everything. 
So let's see. I'm gonna check is there uh besides okay event war challenges Okay and for now it's gonna do a solo for now so okay, so we're doing plunging. Okay. Which okay, I see that. Am I supposed to okay. disappear? Keep. Keep. Hopefully. Next one. Here. Worthless. Here. Nice. I thought I thought you finished them all. <laughs> the walls try turn to break the blocks. To attack enemies in a short period to summon shockwaves to defeat the enemies. A oh, normal attack, okay. Oh, I get it now. 
I think two more left, right? Beto's elemental skills to hit the balls for points. Oh, is this soccer again? Alright. Also, oh, I cannot use normal charge, okay. So these are the counter strike, uh, counter attack ones. Curveball, I have it. These curveballs. Wow, at least it was fun. <laughs> I didn't know like, I had uh, that wide range to att with attack. I I, I thought I could, I could only do like a little bit at a time, but it was like between those two uh, pillars. I messed what. I to, okay, so I'm guessing that this is like basketball, right? Stop that one. Can I bring it back or? Let's see, bring it back. Make it easier. Oh, they blocked it. Get in there.
So that was the, I just had to figure out that Gina had that other thing that uh, did a vacuum. So this one I think I have to do the swimming. What is that up there? I guess I was doing it wrong. Oh, so those uh, things are the. It gives me stamina. Okay, five minutes. So, okay, so it's the re repeat of uh, saw you doing the elemental freeze thing. <laughs> Alright. Two cruels, elemental skills, elemental burst to break the enemies. Okay. So 
I wonder if this is still three challenges or if there's more. So I was supposed to do that, what, three times or so? Yeah, two, okay, so I'll have to do two more times. But, I guess, <laughs> a lot, if you didn't do this one, it's like a lot of free Primo Gems. Right, let's try what match looks like. It's like everybody's fighting for the for their own slime. This should be pretty easy with just two crows. Four two crows. I don't think the, I don't think the enemy is gonna be level uh, level up or anything like that. Test. 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 Test.
I guess I have to say it, it, it is a little bit. It is faster. Probably did we that's uh, what we did best or something. Oh, no, I guess it doesn't rate it. Okay. I guess we'll do another matchup. The challenges do change. Everybody's gonna fight for a, a certain direction. Let's go this this way.
take it easy. <laughs> oh, another oh, so it's also then again. finished all events so that's a pretty that was a quick one I think I think that might have taken like less than an hour all right let's start collecting all right, this one's I think all right everything's collected everything checked marked check marked What else is left? Event shop is done. Champion progress. Victory. Oh, that's kind of neat. It tells you, uh, like the, the recaps and highlights. It tells you like what, what their bat, their uh, fungi was. Magi shroom. Storm Tress. Gusto Frosto, Rocksteady. Okay, we know all these other ones now. Okay. Alright, let's see. We could do. Actually, let's let's try this. There's a I think there's a quest in the Orange Village. I think since we finished the events, we're starting this. Oh, I I think there was a quest here. I'm gonna check. Maybe I have to go to. The, oh, right, quest uh, battle pass. We completed everything, right? Okay, so night. Talk to. Wait. Sumaru. Oh, 
Okay. Press change reward. If you're not sure one. what to okay. do next, how about I take you on a walk? Let's hopefully this is not a long quest line. I did not unlock the last part of the soul slate. No, I refuse to escort you into the desert. But the mausoleum of King Desra, which has remained the same for centuries, has like undergone a unperceived change. You saw it too just now, didn't you? I need to make a record. It's also my first time seeing this change. However, the sage has prohibited researchers from entering the desert without his permission. I'm not like those rushed young researchers. I dedicate my years to studying in the academia. The answer is still no. Hey, long time no see. Seems like you're still having a nice time in our village. Huh? What are the two of you doing here? I did say that I wouldn't pursue the matter, but you should stop going around deceiving people. I'm getting old, so my time is way more precious than yours. Besides, I have more important business to attend you, so if you would excuse me, uh, want to enter the desert? Not at all. No, not at all. I will never go against the sage restrictions. I just want to... Wait a minute, both of you are all covered in dirt, and you've been holding a scissors stone slate. Did you just return from the desert by any chance? Are the changes in the Malazum of King Detra linked to you? Uh, no, we're frauds. Ha, huh, I knew it. Wait, where did you get the stone slate from? Due to various reasons, practically all the records of the later period of Al Amar civilization has been lost. Even those with the occasional dug up are just fragments. I never seen such a perfect stone slate. No, it's not only me. Even the sage may have never witnessed such a miracle. Huh? You were calling us frauds just a short while ago. Did you really enter the mausoleum of King Dejra as Tejra of Papers described? No, he's a fraud. Please stop joking. I always thought highly of Taja and considered him the future of the human nana. I'm not in the least surprised that he wrote such a wonderful paper. Besides, he receives the gift of the desert, the assistance of a of the exiling traveler like you. Whoa, what a sudden change of attitude. It's like he's taken on a completely different character, just like the storyteller of Lue do. Could you allow me to carefully expect the stone slate? I'll compensate both of you for it. As for the amount, hmm, before that, let's go somewhere quiet so I can take a closer look at the slate. You better not seal it. Phew, it's a lot cooler here. Mind letting me see the slate? Hey, you're spending too much time on this. You're not trying to commit the text to memory and skim on our pay, are you? Sorry, I was just so fascinated. This is my first time seeing anything like this. Any discoveries? Hmm. Some of it looks like a construction log. It mentions Aru, but there's no way to know if it's any way connected to Aru village. Too bad the record says little, little more. But this discovery is certainly worth several pages of writing. Thank you very much. Here, as per our agreement. Uh, you should be thanking Terza instead. That's right. If we weren't trying to prove Terza correct, we, we wouldn't have found this slate. You're right. Terza's the one I should be thanking. Yes, indeed. My next step would be to find a bigger collection of the primary materials. But that's going to be a difficult... That's going to be difficult without going into the desert. Oh, I have an idea. If you had the time, please hear me out. Mr. Sola, are you thinking? The sage prohibits any researcher from going into the desert. 
Now, I wouldn't dare challenge the sage's authority, but I'm sure he never prohibits the giving of gifts, right? Gifts? What are you going to give us? Something very precious, my archaeologist notes. To be honest, I ventured into the desert more than a dozen years ago, but I didn't find anything special other than not noting the location of several potential ruins. I believe it's faith that brought us me back to where. Wait, I believe it's faith that brought me back here to make through your acquaintance in these ruins. So I want you to have these notes. Are you trying to? I get it. This isn't against the rules, but afraid your actions could would. My actions. I am simply presenting a gift to as a celebration of my friendship with the with Bloody Master, the Blink Hero, and Paimon, the Little Hero. Isn't that more than fair? I suppose. The world of research is way too complicated. He could have just come right out and said he needed our help. Instead, we had to go through the whole charade. If you ask Paimon, he's just afraid that the big guy over there would just rat him out to the sages. He must have his reasons. True, but Paimon feels those, those researchers always hide behind the presence of pursuing knowledge. As if he, that justifies everything they do and say. Well... That's one thing you shouldn't turn into, Paimon. Don't worry, Paimon's never been interested in knowledge at all. Let's take a look at what's written in Solo's gift. Day 32. It's been a month since I first set a foot in the desert. During this month, we have recorded everything that would be discovered outside the mausoleum of King Dejra. But what's the use of that? Any potential topic has already been uh, written about. When I saw that people were writing extremely, extremely niche and crunch of paper like the intrinsic preference of structure. Wait, what? Wait, what? Okay, wait a sec. Structure of Dejra civilization and analysis using the pyramidic inclination of the mausoleum of King Dejra as an example. I knew that only way to find a breakthrough would be to enter the mausoleum itself. But we would we couldn't enter the mausoleum. Everything's everyone's patience has been worn out. Not to mention we're running out of drinkable water. Let's give it another day. Hopefully during our last attempt, things will be go according to what the legend says. Spring water will burst forth from the long dried well, and the inlying barrier will finally be shattered. Day 34. I'm returning to Aru Village. 35. I can't just leave empty-handed. I have to think of something, or else I'll become a laughing stock. Day 38. We discovered new ruins, but what are we trying to get closer? A transparent mechanism will push us away, stopping us from proceeding further. I am absolutely certain that Dejra created this mechanism to cover up evidence of a tiny autocracy. Day 40. Uh, day 42. We discovered three more of these transparent ruins, which makes them four in total. However, we still haven't found a way to enter any of them. Going to record, re going to record these locations for now. It feels like there's c some kind of illusion. Perhaps a vision is necessary for cracking the case. I need to look into that. Day forty-five. We arrived at the dunes of Carcel. The cone-shaped ruins that looks like a smaller version of the mausoleum of King Dedra are located here. I guess I could call it the tomb of Carcel for now, though it's a lot smaller than the mausoleum of King Dedra. I still find it hard to imagine how how Dejra enslaved his, his people to build such a structure. Disappointingly, we encountered the same mysterious power as last time, keeping us from entering. I will not waste any more time. We will head further into the desert tomorrow and see if we can find the fabled oasis. <sighs> Let me just get a drink. Day 46. The archaeology team has been attacked by a group of ermites. They call themselves Desmosis. I never heard of that name before. The leader were two young men. One wants to kill us all, but surprisingly, the other young men stopped him and let us go. They seem like Fen. Oh, so that's. That was, uh. Jet's dad. And the other person that uh, 
they both uh, lost in that uh, Eternal Slumber uh, quest. They seem like fantastic believers in Dedra, but they're nowhere near decent. Nevertheless, I hope Dedra will always bless that young man and that his axe will always remain sharp. I have no hopes but to return to the academia and face the ridiculous now. They're rectical now. But to be honest, compared to the mockery, having no improvement in knowledge is more painful to endure. In the boundless force of knowledge, I am, I am but a snail that has only just crawled into one of those branches. I also been thinking, the sheep is in the nearby area often disappears for no reason. The local believes that they were swallowed by the rock formation. So they named the place Land Devouring Rock. There's Omer Ermites suddenly jumped out of the from the rocks, th then disappears into them. If we draw a parallel parallel between them and the disappearing sheep, the answer becomes very straightforward: that their most members might be using a specific technique to hide themselves, or perhaps there's a hidden cave somewhere. Any anyway, I'm gonna write down the location first. If I ever return to this place, I'll hire Ermite from the Thermosis as my guide. Huh. Looks like he's been having a pretty hard time. He explored the area around the Mausoleum of King Dedra for months without obtaining any results. He didn't want to give up, and he found a transparent ruin. And then he found something a lot smaller than the Mausoleum of King Dedra, the Tome of Karsa. Finally, he was attacked by a group of mercenaries in a place called Lamb Devouring Rock. Whoa, even though he went through all that, he still wrote that, compared to the mockery, having no improvement in knowledge is more painful to endure. He sounds like a completely different person. Yeah, seems like he really was in it for the knowledge back then. Palman's a little moved. From his, that perspective, it wouldn't be an exaggeration for him to call his this a precious gift. Let's visit each location mentioned in the notes. If we find something decent, let's bring it to back as a gift to him to, ret to him in return.